my channel eh what to say <laughs> prime pay boys prime pay college boys hey for me it's too much charlie these boys consistency be what back to back winning like anywhere they might go they might they smash 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 the competitions though ah how i love winning team Oh, give it up for the prep boy. Oh. <laughs> oh my goodness, Prempe College. Hmm. Founded in 1949 in the Ashanti region. Named after Asantehene Prempe the first. It's been back to back winning. These senior students keep representing the country, the region, Africa, everywhere they go. They keep making them proud. Local competitions, national competitions, international competitions, global competitions, back-to-back -back wins. Hey! Me, I love quality. Where do you know a day where you say, you know, go compare uh, Nigeria uh, to Ghana for education. Hey, this particular robotic competition we the Maho for um, the University of Michigan we the Prempe boys know. They might battle with Japan, students from Japan. You know what? Japan will be the leading country for robotics. So. US students from the US schools, USA if you even search for Google, no, Google will tell you, say, the best education in the United States. These boys, these are the boys we, our Prempe senior boys, they might go do competition with. We, they might win camp. You know what it means. Like, you, 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 you came into somebody's territory. Like, fearlessly, like the lion. You came, you saw you conquered. Hey, you carry the win. You go back to where you came from. The African way the Mati think say, oh, nothing good they ever come out of, the, of Africa. Our Prempe boys went there, proved them wrong. Proved even those children, you know, the other students, I shall say, oh, the Mati teach them for school, say Africa, it be nothing. Our boys went there. Hey, showed them that, Charlie. This one there, you know, be boga boga or batao. <laughs> Forget whatever they were telling us for school. We are Africans. We are the Prempe Kings. We are here to represent our country. Oh, even though you people, you were born with this robotics thing. You were raised with it. You've been swimming in it. We, we just had small, just 1% of it taught us in school. But we will show you how it is done. Our African brain, you know, it they represent anywhere that we step into. Any place we step our foot into, we they represent. Oh yeah, let's do this you now. We they may prove to them say they might be African kings where they might win this thing, carry and they come back. Oh, how proud I am! I love it. Like it is sweet, my belly. Eh? Hey! Charlie! <laughs> like, oh, like I've been millionaire. Eh? Like I've been millionaire. Hmm. They were for spy these boys. Eh? The, the gift were for gift them. In a, in, a, in, a, in, a, in, a, in a society where other teenagers are busy drowning themselves in alcoholism, drug addictions, they womanize and things, they follow girls up and down and they join courtism and all that, that these boys are laying down their brains, grabbing everything being taught today. Hmm. Special thanks to the teachers who impact these knowledges into these young men. 
it hurts because it is not easy. If the teachers were busy being bullies instead of teaching, if they were busy being intimidating, if they were busy trying to look for a way to steal from them, if they were busy molesting and abusing them, we wouldn't be having this conversation today. These boys wouldn't have been able to go out there United States of America compete with these boys that were born into science, born into engineering, born and breathed inside engineering, robotics car. They went there. They won. God will continue to bless the teachers who made sure these boys keep doing what they know how to do best. And the boys that calmed down to learn, God will continue to bless them and open more doors for them because it will not be easy, craft. Hey, Charlie, the way I make proud, eh? The way I make proud of these Brimpe boys. Hey, like I wish see one of them if be my younger brother or if be my son, craft. We are going to see brother. Yeah, that one. Yo, you don't see that one. It be my brother that or my son that. <laughs> Where is Dino? Where Dino day? We Dino where they say, oh, Nigeria and Ghana, you can't compare education. Please, Habeck, show me. Waiting do Nigerians, they might not they teach robotics. Why Nigeria no go for that competition? At least other schools, uh, they must suppose follow go represents uh, for the competition. No. The boys, we, you know, be say the hot brains no day for Nigeria. Very smart kids, very intelligent kids. The only problem they are facing is the environment, the society they found themselves. The society is not safe for their physical and their mental health. Until the system starts getting it right, making it conducive, for the young leaders of tomorrow to be safe and learn in a very, very loving and sane environment, they will have keep having a long way to go. The, world, the government schools, the boys are busy, some of the boys are busy joining cultism, the ones we go they pursue girls, they go they pursue girls, the ones we go they do fraud, they go to do fraud. The ones we go to fight, fight, they buy each other, they bully each other. The ones we go to do cocaine, uh, drugs and things and alcohol and smoke and things, that be it. And then the conducive ones, the private schools, we, the, we suppose produce these results be, is not safe either in there. The bullies, something could do your child no no accountability. You're not even sure of the safety of your child. If fellow students no bully them, teacher go bully them. Nigeria is not a safe place for schools for children. They need to sanitize the educational system. If a child where they study for a safe environment, we go fit to grab waiting not to learn something a crammer because he made a teacher for no bit time to, to buy but at least learn and understand what they are being taught the highest paid robotic engineer he be nigerian guy in the whole world silas adekunle he is a nigerian guy he is the highest paid robotic engineer in the whole world Oh, but you know, grow for Nigeria. When he be teenager, no way they travel go uh, England. He be there in school, no. He be there, he become who he become. So like he day Nigeria, no. For no, they see in them for Google say, oh, he be relevant. So you see, I keep telling people the environment you raise your children has a lot of roles to play. That be why me, I just 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 carry my children no come up for that country. Because I don't see MC, there is no future there for my children. 
the kind of future cry we are for like me they get, you know they there. So there's no point wasting it there until the system is fixed. They have a lot of work to do. So Prem Pe College, keep making Ashanti region proud, keep making Ghana proud, keep making Africa proud. Even 2023, May 2023, the same robotic competition held, the, the robotics competition held, and these boys still smashed. The robotic team still won last year. The same thing this year. How I love consistency. Hey, now we ask, what is World Robotic Competition? The World Robotic League is a robotic competition for students of all ages to participate using a variety of robotics and programming languages. Yeah, trust me, most majority of the people who would have um, really, really gotten this right is in the universities. I am not sure robotics engineering is being taught in secondary schools. I am not sure. The universities know we they might learn these things from Nigeria. But look at these boys, making everybody proud. So, Charlie. Give it up for this boy. <laughs> oh, I love good news. Hmm. So please, boys, keep it up. Keep it up. Please, please, please. Keep it up. Focus. Focus. Keep making us proud. Say no to alcohol. Say no to cultism. Say no to fornication. Say no to raping. Say no to disrespecting of girls. Say no to um, drugs. Say no to violence. Say no to any kind of say no to fraud say no to any kind of thing that will destroy your future just maintain the pace and you find out that the, the sky is just a starting point for you hmm? so sweethearts if you are new to my channel <laughs> i am ella chilaka hmm? the one and only the most beautiful, the most gorgeous, <laughs> the most loving Queen Abuda of Ghana. <laughs> you are welcome to my page. Please, if you have not subscribed, do me the honors and hit the subscribe button, sweethearts. I would really appreciate it. And do not forget to give me some thumbs up on this video. Help me to share it. Let's um, YouTube suggest it for more audience okay i really appreciate it please and please 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 engage me in the comment section i love it when you do that <laughs> my Ghanaians, what do you think contributed to the success of these young men making us proud let me know in the comment section thank and you for watching my video and i'll see you in the next video. Ha! Me dao pa! Mwah! <laughs>